Hey, I am coming to you from the kitchen floor because apparently the kitchen floor seems to be the place to be. So here I am on the kitchen floor with, I don't even know how to like, I need to vent, but I don't want to vent because I don't want to be involved, but I'm involved kind of. It's really moldy tea. <laughs> it's tea, but it's moldy tea. Um, I don't even know how to like start. And I didn't want to do this video. And I was like, because it's dumb, because no reason for me to do this video. <sighs> so yeah, this has been bugging me for a couple of days. So I'm going to vent and you're going to listen. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. It could go two ways. I could either get a lot of hate or I could get people who don't hate. But I'll probably get a lot of hate. Because again, I'm like trying to be neutral. But this is like an outsider's... I'm an outsider kind of looking in type of scenario on this situation, but I'm kind of also involved. So yeah, kitchen floor me guys. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to do. So <laughs> everybody knows that I was a social repose fan. Like I was a big stan. Like, Two years ago, I was a big stan. Like, I would have, like, fought you over, you know, but he's a good guy. And he's, you know, he wouldn't do that to people. And, and everybody makes mistakes and blah, blah, blah. And just, it's, it's one of those blah, blah, blah things. And honestly, this time around, I really, like, don't even want to be involved, but indirectly. I'm involved, kind of, sort of, I don't know. <sighs> so, he did it again. He cheated on his girlfriend. And I know this because I was talking, I was talking to the girl that, well, he slept with the girl's friend that I was talking about, or talking to. So she, my, not my friend, this girl, well, the girl that I was concerned about, because I'm, you know, hi, I care about people, and, and if she's upset, and suddenly she's an ex-fan, and, you know, I reached out to her, and I said, hey, what's up? And she told me, you know, she, he slept with her friend. Well, apparently, his girlfriend, he was dating someone? Well, his merch girl, and uh, she found out. I don't know. I don't know if anyone told her. I don't know what happened. I just this this girl that I was talking to was suddenly pissed off and angry and like on the warpath. And uh, I just feel like it's because she didn't get what she wanted, and her friend got what she wanted instead. And I'm not bashing anybody, and I'm not saying names. Uh, so, you know. And this is hearsay and whatever. Yeah, you can sit and say it's hearsay. But if you go, if you go into any of the, like, Twitter stuff, you'll see it. Um, of course, the now ex-girlfriend is, you know, going off and ranting and which leads to the whole, um, the, the other girl, the ex-fan, we'll call her ex-fan number one, ex-fan started a whole, like, Discord chat where, where people who have been hurt can go or whatever, and, and um, honestly, yeah, I was still a part of the, his patron, I was a part of Social Repose's patron for you know, for a while. I kicked in like a couple bucks. It wasn't that much, but you know, 
it wasn't a big deal. But <laughs> since they invited me into the ex Moffling fan group, uh, you know, everyone was telling their sob stories. I'm the victim. This is good to me. Blah blah blah. Uh, they, for some reason, was thinking that I actually was telling what they were saying. Now, okay, guys, I'm going to let you in a little secret. This is a little secret. Just a secret. Richie's never spoken to me. Never. Like, we've never had a conversation. I used to DM him, and he would reply back with a one-word syllable. <laughs> he wouldn't pee on me if I was on fire. <laughs> I don't draw. I'm not young. I'm not gorgeous and pretty and skinny. Well, I guess the skinny part wouldn't matter, but, you know, I don't, I have nothing to bring to the table, so. But for some reason, they got it in their thick little heads that I was the rat. And so they were going to kick me out. And then they decided they weren't going to kick me out, but they're going to prevent me from seeing certain posts because I might share them with him. Um, hi, we don't. We don't talk. He doesn't watch my videos. If you watch my videos, I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, this is, to me, this is crazy. And I wasn't going to bring it up and I wasn't going to talk about it, but... Um, I don't know. So, yeah. I'm indirectly, not directly, not really involved at all, but somehow I was involved. <laughs> Did that make any sense to you guys? So here we are on the kitchen floor because apparently um, he deactivated his Twitter a couple days ago. He's back now, of course. And then there was the requisite video of, oh, it's been two years and my girlfriend broke up with me and I tried to kill myself, and is the shaving of the head going to be next? And I'm sorry, I'm, I, you know, I'm not, I want to feel bad, and I want to, like, give him a big hug and just be like, everything's going to be fine, but, you know, I, if you repeat your mistakes over and over again, and you keep repeating the same patterns, it's not good. It isn't good. And, you know, I'm not just saying that because uh, I didn't get the attention. It's not that at all. Like, I stopped pretty much being a major fan a while ago because, you know, I just... I moved on to other things, and I started following other people, and I started liking other things, and I there was a lot of drama in the chat rooms with the younger crowd. You know, the younger girls didn't want the older people to be in the chat room. And I'm not saying that anything bad has ever happened with any younger girls. I'm not. I'm not saying it's an Anision thing. It's not. Uh, I wouldn't even know, because I wasn't included. I was never included in anything. Uh, those girls didn't want me to know anything. They didn't want to talk to me. They didn't want to, you know, and teenagers. They're all teenagers and they're all angsty and, and like, I get that. Okay, some of them are not teenagers and angsty. Some of them are older. They're 21, 22, 23, but still, you know, you young, younger people. And, um, I don't know, supposedly I'm annoying. Am I annoying, guys? I, I don't, I know I am. It's, uh, it's a part of my ADHD. That I'm, and I'm free, am I freezing? Like, I feel like I'm freezing up, and that's not good. So, yeah, I bring you my angsty kitchen floor rant, because I can, because I needed to vent to get it out of my system and be like, I don't know how to feel. I don't know what to think. I 
like I said, I've never spoken to Richie. Like, we've never talked on the phone. I never phone call. I never Skyped him. I never... We had a couple of little DM conversations that were like, you know, hi, I adore you, blah, blah, blah. Oh, I'm annoying to you. Okay, never mind. You know, it was, it was that type of thing. He didn't like me because I was annoying. He probably... And that's cool. That's fine. I've never met him. Never talked to him. So, I don't know. It could all be in my head. But, I was the biggest stan for a long time. And, uh, I don't know. I don't really... This is probably the only video I'm going to be doing. Like, this will be this. This video is it. This is the video that I'm going to be doing. I think. No, yeah. It's probably the only video I'm going to be doing on this subject. Because there's better things to do. And to talk about. And, um, creepy. You know, uh, if you go into my short stories, I've written some short stories. And, um, you know, I think they're creepy. I think they're like, because I wrote them months ago. Like, months ago. I don't know. My social repose short stories are kind of, they're dark. They're dark, they're angsty, they're, yeah. But that's what, you know, that's what the emotions I've had, or had. The emotional state that I had back then, which was two years ago, a year ago, two years ago. Um, you know, some things have come out. I'm not happy about, I'm not proud of my own intentions. Like if I had had money, I probably would have given him money and I didn't have any money. So <laughs> that kind of thing where I was like, you know, but, and it's like, should I even be posting this? It's not relevant. It's kind of boring. I could talk about so many other better things. I have something better. Come here. Come here, come here, come here. Come here, come here. We have a discussion. We have a problem. Look at, look at, look at, look at. Say hi, everybody. Hi, guys. Mr. Winchester? Mr. Winchester is actually Winnie. My boy is a girl. But, my son and my husband decided they wanted to keep the name Chester, so, Chester it is. Uh-oh, don't play with the camera. No, no, no. No, no, no. Kitty's playing with the camera. Alright, guys. Anyways, I don't want this to be, like, super long. What are we at? Like, I can't even see it. I don't have my glasses on. And I'm hungry. And... Yeah, I don't know, should I be crying and throwing a fit and being like, woe's me, they kicked me out, they don't trust me. I'm not the one you gotta look out for. Um, that's all I gotta say. I, and I wasn't gonna do this video, but I figured everybody kind of knows now what's going on, maybe, hopefully, I don't know. Um, it's not something that's going to be, like, swept under the rug again. Everybody on Twitter is up in arms and, you know, oh no, got to choose sides. And everyone has a sob story. I'm, I'm not victim blaming or victim shaming. I'm not. Because I, you know, everyone has their experiences and everybody sees things differently. So, you know, I'm sorry for the people that are hurt. I'm sorry to the people that, that, and got hurt. Um, I'm sorry I wasn't a better friend. I'm sorry that I, I'm sorry Jacqueline, I'm sorry Frank, I'm sorry whoever that I personally doubted. I'm sorry. Um, I shouldn't have made some videos and I made them and I shouldn't have done it. 
but all I can do is like sincerely, like, like sincerely, sincerely, um, apologize. Gnarly's friend, I am sorry. So, I was wrong. But, yeah, everybody can, I don't know. I think I beat myself up enough already. I've beat myself up. There's just no, nobody can make any me feel worse than I feel right now. So, I'm going to eat. I'm going to go play with Fluff Face, Floof Demon. My bye bye. I'm gonna go play with my kitty. You say bye? Bye. Bye, Internet World. We love you. We love you guys. Go subscribe. I'm almost at 60. <laughs> 60. Woohoo! Go subscribe to the kitty. <laughs> All right. Bye.